Hello and welcome. My name is Nick Teorio, and today I'll be taking you on a journey through the circuit board of a simple sine wave generator. Our journey starts at the source of the power. As we move down our path, you can hear the noise floor generated by the cheap circuitry. We're now encountering our first component, the electrolytic capacitor. After our signal charges, we depart from the capacitor, and now we enter the transistor. Our newly modified signal now goes down our path and encounters our first resistor. As our resistor changes the properties of our signal, you can hear some of the energy being dissipated in the form of heat. Now we're entering the large space and domain of the integrated circuit. As we leave the integrated circuit, we now enter the Zener diode. Our new signal heads into another resistor. As our signal leaves this last resistor, we now encounter a ceramic capacitor. Our signal is now in the final stages of its growth, as we encounter the last integrated circuit. Our signal is now just one component away from being complete. Our newly generated signal is now free to test your sound system.